What's up YouTube? So today's review is going to be on the Duraflame 1500 watt electric infrared quartz portable heater. So in Ohio it is currently 25 degrees and been snowing nonstop. My furnace has been running all day long, all night long, and I seen this Duraflame infrared heater. It's supposed to heat large rooms up to 1000 square feet. And quite frankly, I was a little skeptical because I've had infrared heaters in the past that just didn't work very well. I wanted to try the Duraflame because I've always used their logs in my fireplace and they've always worked very well. I figured when I opened up the box that I was going to have to assemble this thing, attach the wheels, you know, put a bunch of screws in it, but nothing like that. It's literally just take out of the box, turn it on, you're good to go. The first thing I noticed about this was how simple it was. A lot of these come with flashing lights and timers and this, that, and every other thing. All I care about is heating my house. And that's exactly what this does. And it's extremely easy to use. And I'm going to turn this on. I'm going to show you how it heats up. I'll flip it over. I'll show you the wheel so you can actually move this thing around nice and easy. You don't have to lift it up all the time. And I'll also let you take a look at the remote. Yes, it actually comes with the remote. Before we actually get into that, let's actually talk about some of the specs. So this is 5200 BTU. And once again, it will warm a room up to 1,000 square feet. Now let me tell you, it actually does that. I've had other heaters, like I've mentioned, that claimed that they would heat up 1,000 square feet. And they didn't even come close. It's infrared. I believe it comes with six heating elements. Another nice feature about infrared is it doesn't draw out all of the humidity in the air. So a lot of heaters that you turn on, like those fan heaters, they're going to suck the humidity out of the room and you're going to feel dry, right? It's going to be very dry. You're going to start cracking. The infrared doesn't do that. It will actually leave the air kind of moist. Now, mind you, this is winter time. It's going to be dry anyway, but it's not going to make it worse for you. So that's a big plus for me. You do have an adjustable thermostat and it's going to allow you to adjust that temperature between 50 degrees Fahrenheit all the way up to 97 degrees Fahrenheit. So there's a big range there for you to play with. It does sit on casters so this is going to allow you to move it from room to room without picking it up. Which is a good thing because it is pretty heavy. It weighs about 26 pounds. That's because it's actually made out of real wood. Not the cheap stuff. Real wood. I believe it's oak. So it is pretty heavy. Once again about 26 pounds. So that's a plus and I'll show you those casters here in a bit. It has a timer on this so you can set the timer for 30 minutes all the way up to 9 hours. Once again it comes with the remote control right here and I'll show you how that works. Two AAA batteries go in that so uh, pretty, pretty cheap to run that. They even give you a little touch up pen so if you're moving this thing around the house and you bump it up against the wall and it leaves a little scratch they actually give you a touch up pen to, to fix the scratch on it. So that's pretty cool. The other cool thing about this is the safety feature that they built in. Apparently they have some type of uh, patent pending safer plug where if the plug actually gets too hot from leaving this running all the time or just plugged in all the time, which they do, trust me, plugs do get very hot and that's what causes electrical fires. This actually shuts down the unit. So it's a built in safety feature that I like. I think that's great. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn this on using the remote. You can see the remote right here. There's a power button. There's a timer button. There's a temperature up button. And then there's a temperature down button. So I'm going to hit this power button. And you can see it's set at 97 degrees right now. If I don't want it that hot, I can scroll all the way down to 50 degrees. But that's a little cold for me. I like, I like it hot. So I'm going back up to 97. But there's the 50 degrees. And you can set that. It's 65 if you want, 66, 67. Once again, I'm going all the way up to 97. So I'm gonna let that flash here for about three seconds. And then it's actually gonna go down to the actual room temperature. So it's gonna show you what the room temperature is. So it's 61 degrees right now. That's in my basement. And it's going up to 62. Um, now my basement's about 2,000 square feet. So. I doubt it very seriously if this is going to make a lot of difference down here. But that being said, I've had this in my living room, which is a very big living room. And it heats up really quick. And what's nice about this, 
is you can feel the heat. I'm standing about three feet away. You can feel that heat just blowing on you. It's still warming up. So now you can see it's starting to glow here, and I'll zoom in a little bit for you. All right, so this is starting to warm up. Once again, I believe there's six heating elements in here. What's nice about this is it's, it's cool to the touch. Now, if I were to hold my hand on this for more than 10 seconds, it's gonna start getting pretty warm. But if you have kids that come up and accidentally touch this, they're not gonna get burned. So that's, that's a big plus there. But once again, you don't wanna just rest your hand on there because you will get burned, you, know, you will get hurt. But I can touch this and I'm not, I'm not feeling anything. So everything works from the remote if you want it to. Or you can come over here and actually use it right from the, the panel. So if I want to set the timer on this, there's zero, 30, one hour, two hour, three hour, four hour, five hour, six hour, seven hour, eight hour, and then back to zero. So you can set this up to eight hours. It'll shut down by itself. I can adjust the temperature from here as well or I can simply just shut it off right there. So you can use this, once again, from the face or the remote, which actually, actually works really well. So if you're wondering what this is, these are the casters. And they actually swivel 360. And this allows you to move it from room to room without picking it up. Because like I said, I mean, it's 26 pounds, it's pretty heavy but they all swivel, it's, it's easy to move, especially if you have like towel, even on carpet, I got carpet, no problem at all moving it on carpet. The casters are pretty solid. It's very well built. Now with all the good being said, there is one thing I wish they would have added to this. A lot of the other heaters that I've used, if your kid comes over and accidentally tips this over, it would shut down or shut off. This doesn't do that. So if I sit there and move this back and forth, or if my kid comes over and drops it, it's not gonna automatically shut off. I wish they would have added that option. That would have been nice. I'm just letting you know, this does not do that. Other than that, that is the only downside that I have with this heater. It really kicks off a lot of heat. I'm telling you, I'm standing four feet away from that and I can feel it on my entire body. It really radiates out nicely, where a lot of the other ones that I've used just don't do that. So you're gonna get a large coverage area with this. It's definitely gonna heat up a thousand square feet. I'm telling you, it's going to do that for you. I've had a lot that just didn't, this does. It's simple to use, it's built really well. I'm happy with this. I'm gonna be using this for the rest of the winter and it's probably gonna save me a lot of money. If I were to give this a rating between one and five, one being the worst, five being the best, absolutely hands down, I give it a five simple to use built well sturdy i hope this helps if it does please thumbs up subscribe if you have any questions please feel free to ask take it easy